Nicholas's KYC algorithm is way ahead of its time. Hello pioneers. The rapid development of the 4.0 technology era has brought numerous conveniences, particularly in financial transactions. However, this also comes with increasingly sophisticated scams. To access a user's financial accounts, hackers need to gain control of the account. The first barrier they must overcome is the KYC process. While KYC technology has significantly advanced through AI, the same AI has also equipped hackers with deepfake capabilities to bypass traditional KYC methods. Pi Network requires KYC approval to own an account. The KYC technology developed by Pi Network has been a topic of much discussion. Notably, recent attempts to fake KYC and steal accounts have failed against Pi Network's KYC system. What makes Pi's KYC superior? How did Nicholas anticipate technological risks so far in advance? How will this help Pi Network develop, and what can pioneers contribute to this growth? In today's video, let's dive deeper into Pi Network's KYC algorithm. We hope to provide pioneers with a comprehensive view of the technology and techniques behind the project you support. Part 1. How Deepfake Attacks Work in Vietnam Online KYC, also known as eKYC, verifies a user's identity using electronic technology. This process involves using image data, video portraits, and identification documents like ID cards or passports, commonly used in online services. The most crucial elements in eKYC are ID photos and facial recognition. The tool compares the user's face with their ID photo and asks the user to perform certain movements to prove their face is live, such as turning left and right, looking up and down. Hackers can create deepfake images of the user and insert them during the eKYC process to steal accounts. Typically, attackers use man-in-the-middle (MIT-M) attacks, intercepting communications between the user, usually on a phone, and the server, to insert deepfake data into the verification process. From a video call, attackers can take a face and put it on an ID card, attaching it to a moving body to fool the eKYC tool into thinking it is a real person. Another method involves using phone emulation software on a computer and connecting a virtual camera or inserting hardware into a mobile device replaced with an HDMI converter connected to a computer. These techniques allow hackers to access and steal user accounts. Part 2. The Advantages of Pi Network's KYC Technology Now that we understand the KYC data theft issue in the financial industry, let's explore how Pi Network's KYC technology addresses these challenges. According to the Pi Core team, Pi Network has developed a proprietary KYC solution that is cost-effective and globally accessible, even thwarting deepfake KYC attempts by hackers. Pi's KYC combined machine automation AI, with human verification. The human element, called hyperlocal technology by the Pi Core team, involves the pioneer community performing accurate and effective KYC for over 50 million global members. This creates a semi-decentralized KYC system. AI handles image processing, text extraction, fake ID detection, and image comparison. Human verification is done by pioneers who have already passed KYC, reviewing eye processed data from other members, preventing fake account creation. These verification groups operate in over 200 countries worldwide, with 125,000 trusted pioneers verifying KYC applications globally their efforts are rewarded with Pi bonuses. Thus, beyond preventing spam accounts and malicious actors, Pi KYC helps the project comply with legal regulations while fostering a thriving community. In the AI era, Pi Network has built a scalable, decentralized KYC solution, merging machine automation with human verification from community resources to create an efficient, cost-effective, and swift process. As pioneers, to contribute positively to the project, carefully verify KYC applications to ensure transparency. Ensure only real people can mine and receive Pi coins on the mainnet. That concludes today's video. What do you think about the advantages of Pi Network's KYC algorithm? Leave a comment below to discuss with the community. If you found this helpful, please like and comment to support the channel and spread the message to the community, helping everyone understand the Pi Network project and transact safely. Goodbye and see you in future videos.